Hey guys, and welcome back to some more Factorio Workshop. As always, I'm joined by Madzuri. Greetings. How are you doing? I'm alright. Good. So, uh, we're going over another oil build. It has been a while since we've done an oil build, and, uh, this one was submitted by, oh dear, well, here goes a butcher of a name, um, by Frank Bruz Bruzes, uh, I'm sorry if I pronounced that na last name wrong, but, uh, but yeah, so pretty interesting. There's some really, uh, cool parts of it and, uh, and then some parts that don't work, uh, to full effectiveness. And I'll kind of let Zuri cover that stuff here. Sure thing. So it, it is a smart system. It does detect the amounts of a light oil, gas, and lubricant in the system and redirects oil as necessary. Right. So if gas is low, it sends the light oil to be cracked. If a light oil is high, it'll send it to solid fuel. And if gas is too high, it'll send it to solid fuel. So it doesn't jam up. Yeah, and then the same with the uh, lubricant. If the lubricant is uh, high, then it sends the light or the heavy oil to be cracked into the light oil. Yep. Uh, this is missing a very important thing, though. <laughs> it's the uh, flame refuel. You gotta have your fire. Oh, yeah. Most important thing in Zuri's factory flame refuel. So, yeah, that that is, uh, I mean, that is a pretty important thing to have, in all honesty, though. So, is missing that, and then uh, there are some uh, ratio-wise things are not quite right. Yeah, it has too much plastic for the amount of gas that this can produce. Right. Because the sulfur build eats all the gas. It's, it's just a hog for it, really. Yeah, you can see that um, the sulfur does not have enough gas currently, and uh, we did some quick calculations, and essentially between the plastic, all, all four of these, and the sulfur, it needs about 18 uh, petroleum uh, a second. And we figured that between the cracking of the light oil pet petro and then the uh, actual refineries themselves, it produces about 12 and a half uh, petroleum a second, so it's, it's short, and either not all the plastic works, or in this case, the sulfur uh, barely works. And, uh, I mean, other than that, and there's also, I mean, this is really, really tiny and doesn't matter much, but there is one extra heavy oil plant. Um, typically, the ratio is uh, for, for advanced oil processing is five refineries to seven uh light oil to petroleum things to one heavy oil to light oil. Um, again, it really is not that big of a deal, but just wanted to point that out anyway. And, uh, and yeah, was there anything else with the Zuri that you uh, wanted to talk about here? Oh, just some improvements. Of course, productivity modules if possible. It'll help out with some of the issues. It'll slow down some machines. Right. For sure. And then I put an extra refinery on that is basic refining instead of advanced, just so you get a little more heavy for lubricant and flame refuel. Right. That's uh, that's a really important point because you will be short on both um, in this case. And uh, wait, just as far as the productivity modules go, would you put it in everything or what specifically would you put the modules in pretty much literally everything that you can put it in so everything in the setup okay cool fair enough so uh yeah if you just productivity all this it will slow stuff down but uh you will get essentially more bang for your buck if you will um and uh now if we just hypothetically i still don't think it'd be enough but if we did add on that extra um oil refinery doing basic that would help the chemical or the petroleum thing a little bit because it's obviously one extra refinery but I still don't think that that would um, 
that still wouldn't help because it produces even less than advanced oil processing. Uh, so it might add like one extra to the equation, um, but you're still going to be short a fair bit. It'll add 0.8 gas raw and a little more uh, light and heavy. So true. Yeah, it's about one all in all. Yeah, nice. So, you know, still still not enough. You need like 18 here. Uh, but other than that, I mean, it's uh, actually really surprisingly compact for the amount of stuff you have going on here. And uh, the smart system is really cool. Uh, and I mean, it works. It's just, well, kind of. The, the batteries are really suffering because these like never get gas. But um, part of that's just due to, due to how the liquids work. Um, but, but yeah, I think unless you have anything else, Siri, I think that'll probably do it for this one. Nope, that's all I got, I think. Alrighty, sweet guys. So, there you go. As always, a link in the description to uh, get the blueprint for this blueprint string. Uh, if you want to check it out, play with it, use it, tweak it, whatever. Uh, any feedback, questions, concerns, or uh, submissions you have, leave them down in the comments. And until next time, we will uh, see you later. Later.